Connecting you to our community, 11 Connects. Welcome to 11 Connects, I'm your host, Jen Lennon. Today I'm joined by Tim Brooks. He is the president of Low Miller and Company. Tim, welcome. Hi, Jen, great to see you. So tell me a little bit about Low Miller and Company. What do you specialize in and, and what do you do? We are an HVAC distribution company here in Colorado. So we distribute heating, air conditioning, and ventilation products for buildings of all shapes and sizes. Okay, topic of the moment then, Tim, clearly is indoor air then. I, I can only imagine that your phone is ringing off the hook right now with people wanting to talk about how do I get the cleanest indoor air? And you have a solution. You're exactly right. We're here today to talk about Global Plasma Solutions. They make a needlepoint bipolar ionization product that actually cleans and sterilizes the air. So it's kind of interesting. As a, as a 30 plus year HVAC professional, we were heating guys back in the 80s. We became air conditioning guys in the 90s. Thought we became system and controls guys in the 2000s. And then now with this pandemic, we've got to, we've really got to honor the V, the ventilation, and, and realize that we've been circulating pathogens and mold and dust for years and years and years. Now it's very important to make sure that we get clean air. And you're right, my phone's ringing off the hook. I bet. So like you said, we've been circulating the air, but now we really need to clean it. We need to purify it. We need to get rid of those things in the air. And you're telling me the technology, while it may seem new to the everyday consumer, has existed for a while. So explain it to me. How does it work? It's about 15 year old technology. So what we do is we create literally millions of negative and positive ions and put those into the airstream. And when I say millions, millions per cubic centimeter. So just a tiny little square. Um, the particulate count, what it does, what those, what those ions do is they create a charge and they make the particles in the air agglomerate or stick together and make it easier okay. for the filter to catch. The other thing they do with pathogens like SARS-CoV-2, they attack the hydrogen molecule that that, that pathogen survives on. When, it, when they attack the hydrogen molecule and deactivate it, they basically deactivate that pathogen and turn it into a harmless substance. In fact, we did a, a third-party test um, with uh, the FAA and, and Global Plasma Solutions and found that we deactivate SARS-CoV-2, which we all call COVID-19, in 99.4, to a rate of 99.4% in less than 30 minutes. Wow. So this has specifically been tested with COVID-19. It has. It was, a joint, it was a joint effort between the FAA, and it was not on a surrogate. It was on the actual virus itself. So that, that test, I believe, was done around June 2nd, June 3rd is when the, those results came out and um, has really created a lot of confidence for businesses and homeowners across the, across the country. Wow. So destroying at the molecular level and also then transporting out. So, so yes. two things. So what does this unit look like? Can we get it put on our standard furnace or air conditioner? It, it will fit in any air circulating device. It's, it's just a t small blue box that's probably eight inches by two inches by two inches. So it's a pretty simple installation, self-cleaning, so there's no bulbs or anything like that to change out later. It probably has a useful life of eight to 10 years. And so does, it really, release, does it release ozone, Tim? That's what I'm wondering. No, it does not. That's a great question, Jen. It does not release ozone. Ozone is bad for us humans, right? And I think we've all seen it with this heat, ozone alert day, stay inside. Um, ozone is bad. This product actually is the only product in the market that, that um, uh, is covered by the UL, has passed the UL 2998 code that says it does not emit any ozone. Got it. So how do we learn more about the product and find someone who can install it in our home? I would suggest whether it's your home or your business or your school, I would suggest going to our website, lowmillerandcompany.com, go to our clean air page and take a look. We can actually uh, refer you to licensed contractors, whether they're residential dealers in your neighborhood or commercial contractors in your neighborhood that can come out and, um, and provide a, a quick solution. Well, what an important service right now. Thank you so much that, for everything your company's doing, Tim.